nte ani modul be kul kaf ka nyoma mm -hmm. to go to national assembly mm -hmm. petition uh, to use information and information commission you know sign the information commission so yes. access to information mm -hmm. or to go to court and i, I encourage no government or be your parade kata national assembly to use the petition system or the access to information act to the information commission or to go to court to take now to court and the Gambia government uh in deal uh a quail like in a because uh it doesn't make sense number two i'm a national interest staff and number three uh corruption the bj and number four the purpose may alone code is uh, electricity carta Senegal Bulu and Mantarin satisfied. So, in the final analysis, that may be loose can be. Now, um, some of the government contract was in 2017, a start time. I didn't know the journalist, the man of the contract document. No, 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 right. no, 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 and then they to the information commission, and then they to the court. Was Nawek and the Minister of Energy and State House the responsibility is to put a coal like an Yeah, and put a contemporary sort of transparency and accountability. So, in a obligation on the contract document, government OJ to make it public. Yeah, uh, the document is covered. In the Information Communications Act, uh, in a section May 7 deals with proactive disclosure. And a list of documents suffer that government more money in Karawala uh, automatically you should just make it available. Mm -hmm. So a contract document uh, may not written in Senate uh, sign, we move government's a right letter to see it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Um, because we are them in the in the in so that when you look at it, uh, we are regular audited accounts report all day 2019, uh, 2020, 2020, where I indicate you send like payment to uh, sort of independent suppliers like Senelec and Car Power mm -hmm. 1.9. 1.8 billion uh 2020 i think and about 1.6 billion 2019. that is for the year mm -hmm. then all of a sudden 2024 you are telling us uh karisaba 1 billion mm -hmm. so i think woman 1.2 woman tembe <laughs> yeah, yeah. Uh, so it was for the full year, near or journal for yeah, just so for three months, one billion, yeah. and for a whole year, 1.8 billion. Mm -hmm. Uh, it doesn't make sense. Mm -hmm. So, that at the end of the day, when my union can in fact, um, in that contract document between Tan Namek and Senelec, so far, you don't let job. And what are the terms? Because coming in Kuran Kundo Menka, the last would be a press release body, you call power. Technical problem happened in Senegal. Yeah, yeah. So, when they affect. Now, according to the contract, well, technical problem in Senegal is not our fault. Mm -hmm. So, contract document, I am only for, for situations like that. Mm -hmm. Should Gambia pay for that? Should we suffer for it? For free or Senegal for it and then compensate? Because that is not our problem. Yeah. So, that is why I come out of contract document. But more importantly, also, is the fact that uh, electricity, the technical problem in Senegal, I made and the, is that electricity is a national security issue mm -hmm. because the life depends on electricity. electricity yeah. The life of the country depends on electricity. Mm -hmm. uh, businesses, you know, health, education, mm -hmm. uh, security, and so on. So, uh, something like electricity outsource, like in the way of the Kenyan with car power mm -hmm. and Senelec. Um, I'm a banko market pro banko and our own capacity develop to produce electricity. But this so we don't have the financial muscle, PRA or whatever. Yeah, right. So but then the if, if you if you pay mm -hmm. one billion, if I pay one billion in three months. Yeah, yeah. And we know also 
grants and loans, and I remember journalists were there, from 2017 to date, grants and loans. And some of it, you can see it in the Auditor General's report. Mm -hmm. NAREC has been bailed out by Swiss security, by government, multiple times. Now, in the end, Several you know, it becomes a fun, it becomes a joke. Yeah, yeah, and still the service is not good. So, therefore, now that I've done more, I could do promo better. And in that form, we PR and I interviewed some few years ago. Yeah, yeah, I remember. Uh, mil, Fifteen million dollars mm -hmm. disappeared in the uh, Ajib Bank account. account yeah. And uh, as far as I know, I remember police also they recovered two million. Yes. So why is the rest of the the, the, million. the millions and the missing millions? So, so now that man are transparent, now that man accountable, and the Minister of Energy man transparent, man accountable, and Gambia government at state house are not transparent and accountable about now. So this is why now that issue should go to court. Citizens should take it to court. Regarding this one. So, yes. So, uh, so but the whole entire mm. operations of now, mm. because look, uh, many years ago, mm. uh, Jame, you generator in Atinanja. For a silol phone call country, silol country, food bridges will be just work. He removed them and they took them to Brikama. Yes. And he called GEG as an independent power producer. Um, but we are still in this problem. Jame at, at that time, Jame said, you know, I can come on, I can draw. If by 20, by 20, that for, for 30 laws only, Electricity will be taken of the history, otherwise I'll eat pork. Yes. Uh -huh. <laughs> uh, when Barrow came, 2017, mm -hmm. the first protest was Occupy West Frame. Mm -hmm. And top in the agenda. I remember, of course. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Electricity law. Mm -hmm. Yep. And the was by about around October 2017, October, November. Yes. Then Barrow went to Nawek. Mm -hmm. It's in the news, people can Google it. Mm -hmm. And said by December, electricity became a thing of the past. Yeah. This 2017, right mm -hmm. in 2024. And when you talk about network, it's not just electricity, it is water also. Mm -hmm. And then you come so and look at the overall uh, output of network, and that is the overall service provision. Because Gambia got 2.4 million. All right. Not all Gambians are getting electricity. Mm -hmm. Most homes don't have electricity. So network is not providing up to one million house for, I mean, Gambians with electricity. And then we are in this problem with that huge amount of money, a billion dollars to be paid in three months. What kind of invoice is that? So people need to see that invoice. What are the items in that invoice that would amount to 10 billion safer? So, so you know, like, uh, Minister of Energy and the government, you know, like, issue uh to the National Assembly for the Petitions Committee to open a public inquiry so that we know exactly uh electricity and water supply the run can in this country. The resource and commence spend what are now as real problems because I think they are not telling us the truth. Uh, we need to go to uh, information commission. Mm -hmm. You know for now here and Minister of Energy and State House to submit to them requests to provide information. And one of them is the contract document. Mm -hmm. One. Two, the SOE commission. Mm -hmm. Your report here on NAWEC. Mm -hmm. They have not made it public. My report on no, it. Yeah, All right. Mm -hmm. Three, uh, Barrow and NAWEC. Mm -hmm. And some SOEs signed performance contracts mm -hmm. sometime last year or two years ago. Mm -hmm. uh -huh. Yeah. So the performance contract also, mm -hmm. we don't see them. So many Ghana government mampare lankena mo ani kodi bo nawek la koro and nawek kodi jamala dunda nawek you know internal and external sources and still uh, water and electricity bo big problem so um, there I think this uh, invoice from Senelec I dispute it yeah yeah and I want nawek I challenge nawek. That's why I, I don't know whether I saw it, but I made a, a challenge on Facebook. And I challenge you to engage NAWEC, mm -hmm. Minister of Energy, I, I and, and the State House that Mari says, mm -hmm. 
he wants to fast a fast debate on the work. Ha, state house, state house, mm. the mm. president, the chief of staff, the vice president, the vice president, anybody that they want the minister of energy, the permanent secretary, minister of energy, the managing director, of NAVIC, the board chair, NAVIC. I challenge them individually and collectively to come and talk about NAVIC. Any day here or anywhere they want. Because I think NAVIC, uh, incompetence, LBJ, corruption, LBJ, inefficiency, LBJ, and you know, they are. Um, mortgaging the future of this country. Because uh, electricity and water are key drivers of the economy, of life. And well, that provision should be excellent. And there's absolutely no, no reason. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you know, there, there's absolutely no reason mm -hmm. uh, why NAVIC, all right, and by extension, Gambia government at mm -hmm. uh, Funko Kenola 24-7 um, mm -hmm. on interrupted water and electricity supply at uh, Gambia Kung Fu Kung. Yeah, but if we say oh, we are not able to supply, the, uh, the PR was very honest to say, oh. anyway, I don't know whether I can call it honest, but I call my Kodoso. That's what I want to say. I call my Kodoso 100% electricity in Gambia. So saying the Kurota and the Kurota can car power and also um Senele. Which is so, not free. Yeah, which is which is which is not free. Say, but exactly. Sorry. So that would be why can't you invest it on your own? Mm -hmm. And gradually you will finally get there. But mm -hmm. then you take huge sums of money to give it to uh, 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 you know an uh Nakale Kurohatesa and a third party yeah. And you just continue to be who where you are. So, yeah. Instead, yeah. you're even deteriorated. Yeah. What kind so, of sense so, does so, that so, mean? So, Biba, uh, um, uh, you know, I, I, I'll take PRO and then for Kuma Kensola. Mm -hmm. The point we meant, mm -hmm. the Gambia government, and maybe that is not even starting with Baro, mm -hmm. since independence, a man serious about national development. All right. In which water and electricity, utility, is in the heart of it. Now, for example, um, 60 years, we are 60 years. Mm -hmm. Let's say Barrow's government is, is eight years. Mm -hmm. um, there are many ways you see electricity at coal at just mm -hmm. Now, for example, uh, we have municipalities, area councils. From the city of Africa, okay, maybe we take a decentralized approach. Najibe, how can we make KMC take care of uh, electricity and water in KMC? Mm -hmm. What capacity KMC and Munin need? What support KMC and Munin need? And KMC themselves, Munin liberated Bulu, what ideas is he meant to use? I mean, you know, Mira Law, Kaje and the electricity sort of the Yabi. Bearing in mind, uh, is either like generator sun or we use renewable energy? Mm -hmm. We have sunlight 24-7. Now, if you go to a lot of these ministers' homes, mm -hmm. I'm sure they have a solar panel up there mm -hmm. or a private generator. Now, we see solar panel cannulas work on, and many homes have that in the Gambia. Yes. Can we think of how do we create solar panels at a larger scale for the municipality, for the area council, West Coast region, mm -hmm. for example? Now, we have a lot of wind here, mm -hmm. and I know... Uh, when I was at Tango, some 10 years ago, mm -hmm. a German came to Gambia. Mm -hmm. And after wind energy, not the government, but the government, the country for free. Mm -hmm. uh, the policy dialogue organized sometime 2012 or 2013 at Tango on about national development. And if I could remember, the president of the uh, 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 Gambia Chamber of Commerce, mm -hmm. I think, remember uh, that uh, the Bamata drama, a appeal kije. Could this German left the government minister Jala Bejeno? Yeah, if you recall, at one time uh, there was a, a, a windmill. Huh? No, no, he had one mill uh, after Tanje. Mm -hmm. There used to be a windmill plant there. Yeah, yeah, more. Uh -huh. All right. Yeah. So, when Germany knew nothing, they want to help. Yeah, yeah, German government, when they were destroyed. 
just to show a call, mm -hmm. the capacity of premium energy produce mm -hmm. is here. And it's not expensive like we cannot do it. Mm -hmm. Now, we, we mean, one, one mean, that, that million, one million, that two million, 11,000 square kilometers. We, we don't need 10,000 windmills, for example. Mm -hmm. And especially in Nigeria, most of them can provide. Mm -hmm. Again, at Tango, mm -hmm. I remember uh, in that same program, mm -hmm. UNIDO, mm -hmm. UN uh, Industrial Development Organization, mm -hmm. you sample uh, solar and windmill plants are strong. I remember we went to Lemon Creek. One plant was there, and I think the, the one member, uh, uh, Q City, sort of mm -hmm. because private companies also can work and they can assist you with wind, wind power mm -hmm. or solar power. So that opportunity, be jelly. Now, who basically explore knowledge, all right, and maybe if a government will explore because, but because new man could sort of quote, all right, it will get interest sort of a quote. Mm -hmm. So that is to say, uh, among man could cool problem sort of. The problem is you and me having the commitment, the interest. Kabanko, Kabanko bonding. Yeah. So that approach is there. What can we think of decentralizing it so that uh, KMC has an you know, energy source, uh, Bandul has, you know, URR, CRR, and then uh, how do we have a natural backup? Can we day connect? If there's a problem in KMC, uh, energy, Brikama, I mean, uh, West Coast can supply. All right. Whether it's generators or wind power. Mm -hmm. I'm just saying this, Kafuko, me and Sita, mm -hmm. as, as educated human beings, and this expertise we know. Because now, now we can call Minister of Energy, it has a story told around the world. Mm -hmm. And electricity, car, electricity provide. Boba. Boba, in 2024, in the world, I mean, no country can uh, cry about that. You go to countries, electricity is so normal, you think it is nature. They have all studied in Netherlands, in UK, in the US, in, in France. And they are human beings. Mr. Susan. No, no, I'm Jamati. Jamati. I'm going to come back. I'm going to come back. I'm going to come back. No, 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 uh, I want to know when Tala Mundo Kula come in Montplace, and there as a citizen, the Manta President tend to look at the world for a safe terms because I'm not working for the president, okay? They are okay. working for government people, so for a terms on safe, uh, in the Doko Nalong, and you know, Murano Dokoti, and official Bunda Bunda Bunda, and then the Doko K, based on professional ethical standards. According to the laws of the Gambia, okay. so, okay. so, so minister, minister mm -hmm. or yeah. permanent secretary or MD, yeah. yeah, okay, yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Uh, so, so, okay. so, 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 regarding this um, electricity system, and the do, do you think of the national leadership contributed? So, we listened to Gallo, um, Mimila managing director. I hope in two years' time, I mean, I, 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 I think whatever in two in two years' time, the ambassador. Now, when you listen to the president, I think we have enough capacity already, so a generator will fall. But the leadership is telling us, go, um, Gallo, who was there, who is there for a very long time now, I hope in two years' time they will they will solve well, the problem. I, yeah, I don't I don't believe uh, in two years' time uh, a solve because uh, even though I'm not an engineer, mm -hmm. um, I'm not in direct staff, monetary Mansakunda, like Minister of Energy. But as an adult, educated, normal human being, mm -hmm. committed, interested in Gambia, mm -hmm. when I look at uh, the energy sector, mm -hmm. uh, in terms of the policies they have, mm -hmm. in terms of experience, in operations, nuclear history, when they were GUC, mm -hmm. all right, to today, looking at the infrastructure, even at my home, 
na polo juma men na na service pool to na so ko juma ni nga be ji kan na on sunday nga na we call bricam office and the response is mamuso from kanaya and ko ko kana sene bi ko 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 fine so that is about uh the infrastructure the resource level bel and nawet nyame uh what to solve mola in the next you know two years with the kind of leadership member nawe so ni galo fo i dispute it and i want him we go to a debate on that nawet mo tari o situation because now in uh they are not investing properly the resources of nawek to for the effective efficient running of nawek um the leadership member nawek in my commitment sort of the management and the board of directors all right and i challenge them to show me any commitment and i know right now as we speak nawek has a strategic plan 2020 to 2025 you understand mm -hmm. we are in 2024 right and part of them strategic plan solar energy is in it mm -hmm. now all the efforts they make right now are not for any significant level to even guarantee uh uh, uh bruce be I, i mean or uh, you know uh, i don't know this area is called what tranquil tranquil mm -hmm. uh on interrupted 24/7 electricity so uh, so i think mr gallo all right kuma kanso na foka a just like the minister just like president baro a be kuma kanso na foka ye fo ate fo le ala ta won la bang a ye men fa e fa ta ta won la bang o ba fo kan ne dro but ala bra ko na ye de enough capacity so don aman so to and you know and and them make right now men of fire you should hold them to account because it's a very serious issue can the president mislead but i like i like chairman kufine on the spoke person of the youth wing of npp when you want to gain nani of course minister that's promotion now so now and again uh but to just show come the capacity tj look um we see electricity lines let's see lines be in this country you know called this electricity lines before you are born since you are born this is the same thing you see mm. that improvement banking in coal there's no order there but the same thing in the 70s in the 80s in the 90s they just continue yes mindo rero gambia and i resigned <laughs> and then ndara be work at jrf na and i resigned because i'm man agree with the work of rajano So I'm in Mankolea, in Boko Mankolea. No 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 no, I, I resigned and I was unemployed for for few few months and in Ndoko so. Me um uh the three men that are named Taliban that you man came masakunda ko defa. Even in my family. Uh three men that are named Telala Hanim Bama Kawala. That that's my principle. I owe allegiance to nobody, to nothing other than my conscience and what is true. Do the life principle is based on that. All right? Buba nyin boko man kolaya. No. Because none cannot tell us among the expertise on the education, the qualification so tong about running Nawek as a technical area, energy as energy, you know, power producing, you know, distribution, uh, you know, transmission agency or among uh capacity so the expertise so the knowledge so about planning, about forecasting, about budgeting about management administration no we cannot say that so why is your company in shambles and you are a monopoly in this country there's no more than men can now compete yes yes so all public enterprises in this country should be doing very very well but as i said it here some time ago why is q cell afri cell growing and gum cell is dying mm -hmm. why And because at, at the end of the day there are some taxes to sell the official come job there are places they go to buy property you know to build their offices and so on uh themselves doesn't do that because it's, it's a state owned company 
But at the end of the day, whether state owned or private, there are certain principles, processes, practices, they all are basic. Standards. Budgeting, planning, mm -hmm. all right, decision making, administration, human resources, management. Whether you, you are private or public, that one, the, the basic principles are there. So why cannot Norwick apply those principles and give us an efficient service? So we don't go to Mankolea. I'm Mankolea.